Alright, what is going on guys, it's Taz here, and welcome back to the channel. Now today we've got for you guys is my reaction and a small little breakdown of the first official trailer for Avengers 4 that we actually got the title for as well. It is officially titled Avengers Endgame, so this is one title that I think a lot of us guessed at one point or another, so it's very cool to see that this is the actual title of the movie. I'm super excited about this trailer, and I'm sure you guys are as well, so just without any further ado guys, let's actually watch this trailer. All right, so three, two, one, let's start it. Broken Iron Man mask. All right. Tony reached on his hand to it. Okay. This thing on. <laughs> Man. If you find this recording, don't feel bad about this. Okay. Part of the oh, he's seen the guardianship. Just for the record, being adrift in space with zero promise of rescue is more fun than it sounds. All right. Food and water ran out four days ago. Very interesting. Oxygen will run out tomorrow morning. Okay. That'd be it. When I drift off. Man, Tony is just so defeated. It's always you. Man, this is so sad. <laughs> I literally want to cry. This is so sad. Marvel Studios. <laughs> the dust effect. Thanos hanging up his armor? Alright. Thanos did exactly what he said he was gonna do. Yes, he did. Avengers compound. He wiped out Man cap. <laughs> of all living creatures. Oh, Shuri and Peter are dead. Alright, we know that, but I guess okay. Oh, <laughs> Thor. Nebula on the guardian ship as well. You lost family. Ronin. Please tell me that's Ronin Hawkeye. Lost part of ourselves. Yes, it is Ronin Hawkeye. All right. Awesome. This is the fight oh, cap back in the. This is gonna work, Steve. What's well, gonna work? They going in the. I don't know what I'm gonna do if it doesn't. <laughs> Time travel? Going in the quantum realm? What are you guys doing? Oh man. This trailer. Avengers Endgame We're in the endgame now Hi, uh, is anyone home? <laughs> this is Scott Lang We met a few years ago In airport, in Germany Got a job really big Is this an old message? Ant-Man? <laughs> yeah, I, you know, I know you know that It's the front door <laughs> Can you buzz me in? <laughs> Well, I guess he gets out of the quantum realm. So that was a crazy trailer, guys. I'm so excited for this movie. That was awesome. Let's just go back through it and break it down a little bit. There wasn't too, too much in that trailer, but there's a, a couple little things that I do want to talk about. So yeah, let's just go back through the trailer. All right, so starting back at the beginning of the trailer, what we have here is we just have Tony's helmet and, you know, it's, it's kind of destroyed because... You guys know what happened at the end of the last movie, <laughs> the uh, Titan battle and everything. So it's just we get this nice kind of long scene here with Tony recording some messages for Pepper. So, you know, he's just out adrift in space, like he said in the trailer, and he's stuck on the Guardian ship out in space. No food, no water, anything. He's just out there and he's all on his own, except we do see later on in the trailer that Nebula is also there as well because, you know, she was the only one left on Titan once, you know, everything kind of happened. <laughs> everything went down and everybody turned to dust. So, you know, he's just so down and defeated after everything. And it just, just like everybody else was, everybody that was watching the movie and everything, we're just, uh, just kind of distraught. Tony is basically us <laughs> when we uh, finished up watching Avengers Infinity War for the first time. So it's nice to see that, you you know, they're going to kind of, you know, go in depth with all of the, um, what do you call it? Just kind of the reactions of everybody to the snap and everything. And I love that little snap, um, Marvel Studios logo there with the dust and everything. And then here we have a very cool picture here of Thanos or not a picture, but just a little part of here with the Thanos suit or Thanos's armor or whatever from the end of, I guess, from the end of the, of, uh, Infinity War, but it's got the helmet and everything, so I guess that's, you know, the full, <laughs> the full gear that he had from the start of the movie with the helmet and all, uh, so yeah, we've got the suit there, and it's just there, and that's on his, Thanos' little farm, and he's there, and I'm pretty sure if you go frame by frame here, we can see 
that the gauntlet is still destroyed, the infinity gauntlet is still kind of messed up here. So not sure how much time has passed since the snap itself, but it's going to be pretty interesting to see if the gauntlet is going to still work now that it's kind of, you know, messed up. So Thanos kind of poured it away at the end of Infinity War. Was that the kind of last charge? Does it not work anymore or what? We're going to, it's going to be pretty interesting to see. So now continuing on with the trailer, we go to the Avengers compound. Really like this compound. It's pretty cool. And then we've got here, <laughs> we've just got Steve here. He's crying. He's just, you know, distraught. Everybody's dead. I think he's really crying because Daredevil got canceled. Uh, I, I cried a little bit, but you know, <laughs> he's crying after the end of Infinity War. Everybody's dead. We have Black Widow here just confirming, yeah, 50% of everybody ever just died. So Scott Lang missing. Shuri's dead, I guess. So that's pretty interesting because, you know, Peter Parker's dead too. So I guess over here, all over on the right side, we see those are the people that are dead. So Shuri's dead. So who's in charge of Wakanda now? We all kind of thought that she was still alive and she was going to kind of take up rule because Black Panther died. But with her dead too, that's going to be pretty interesting to see. So they do think that Scott Lang is missing, but we all know that he's not. Well, I mean, I guess he kind of is. He's in the quantum realm, but we do see that he gets out at the end of the trailer. But continuing on here, we've got um, another sort of shot of inside of the Avengers compound here. We've got Thor just, you know, he's just distraught as well. He looks like he's <laughs> he's just, uh, you know, just chilling here, but he's just really kind of upset about what happened. He's still got that um, other eye as well, if you guys can notice. So that's pretty cool that he keeps it and... You know, I guess that didn't <laughs> that didn't get affected by the snap. Um, but we've got Nebula here on the Guardian ship as well, like I said before. And, you know, she's the only one on this ship with Tony. So it's going to be pretty interesting to see their interactions. But here we get the part of the trailer that I was just so excited for. We get our first look at Hawkeye Ronan. <laughs> Black Widow is the audience right now. We see Hawkeye for the first time in forever. We knew that he was going to be Ronan in this movie, and I'm just so excited that Hawkeye's back. Hawkeye's always been my one of my favorite Avengers, for sure. Uh, you know, I just, I don't know. <laughs> I just really like uh, bow and arrow characters. I love the green arrow. I love Hawkeye as well. So, you know, Hawkeye's been awesome. Uh, just super excited that he's actually going to be a major player within uh, Avengers 4, Avengers Endgame. So it's going to be really cool to see Hawkeye guy in action back again obviously as Ronan this time but continuing on we do see Black Widow and Cap here inside I guess one of the uh, Avengers jets or something and he's back within the Winter Soldier suit so that is for sure my favorite Captain America suit and it seems like they're going to you know they're trying to figure out what they're going to do he's looking at the uh, sort of little compass here with uh, Peggy Carter on it and they're trying to figure out what they're going to do to try to save everybody and they're like oh we hope this works and you know I'm <laughs> just going to see what happens so I assume this is when they're going to try to, you know, go try to fix everything. Are they going to be using time travel? Are they going to be going through the quantum realm? Whatever they're going to do, I'm pretty sure that that's going to be after they actually meet Scott Lang for, I guess, the second time, um, because he does pop up here at the end, and we see the Avengers Endgame title card, and this is just awesome. I know that there were a lot of people saying Endgame, like, right when Infinity War came out because of Doctor Strange's line, we're in the Endgame now, so a lot of people were thinking, oh, this is going to be Avengers Endgame, and then everybody was like, oh, no, you know, you can't, you've never guessed the trailer title, you're not going to ever guess it, we know it, you don't know it, but... It's Endgame, and I think that that's the perfect title for the movie. It was set up within uh, Avengers Infinity War, and I just think that's a great callback to Infinity War. The title of this movie was set in it, so Endgame, we are in the Endgame now, and then we have Ant-Man here show up outside of the Avengers compound. Cap and everybody are just like, wait, what? what's going on here? He's like, is this an old message? No, he's here, he's back, and he's ready to help everybody. So he's out of the quantum realm, comes out in April. The poster says April 26th, so that's really awesome. We don't have to wait until May. Again, we're going to get it in April, just like we got Infinity War last year, and I'm just so excited for this. This teaser was pretty great. It didn't show too, too much, but it was really awesome, and I'm just super hyped for this movie. I think there's a possibility it could be even better than Infinity War, and Infinity War was probably my favorite Marvel movie. So overall, guys, great trailer. I really loved it, really enjoyed it. Didn't show too, too much, like I said, but, you know, it just hypes It just hypes me up. It just builds some hype. I want to know what you guys thought about this trailer down in the comments below. Did you like it? Did you not like it? Are you hyped for Avengers 4 Avengers Endgame? Are you excited about the title? Did you guess it? Did you think it was going to be something else? Do you like the title? Do you wish it was something else? Just let me know your thoughts on all of this down within the comments below. So just in case you guys were unaware, we are supposed to be getting a Spider-Man Far From Home trailer tomorrow, so keep your eyes and ears 
Avengers peeled to social media and the internet and everything. If whenever it drops, I'm sure you guys will see it there. And if we do get a trailer, I will for sure be doing a video in this style for the Spider-Man Far From Home trailer as well. But yeah, with that said, guys, I just, I'm so excited for this movie. I can't wait for it. April can't come soon enough. But until next time, guys, it's been Taz. And I'll see you guys in the next video.